So uh, here, it has been told to prove that the line through the points A and B intersects the line through the point C and D. So first we need to, uh, so if the equation of a line L1 is suppose R vector equals to A1 vector plus lambda B1 vector, and the equation of a line L2 is given as R vector equals to is uh, suppose R vector equals to A2 vector plus lambda B2. So, so it is not lambda, it is suppose mu B2 vector. Then, um, then if L1 intersects, if L1 intersects L2, then we should have then a2 minus a1 dot b1 cross b2 that should be equal to 0. So here we have the points a and b. a is 0 comma minus 1 comma minus 1 and b is 4 5 1 4 5 1 and we have the point c and d the point C is 3, 9, 4, and D is minus 4, 4, comma, 4. Then uh, the line CD, if the line CD intersects, the line CD intersects AB, <laughs> then we should have this. Then, So first, we need to find the equation of the line AB. So for, for that, we should write A, r vector equals to which is you can write 0 i cap minus j cap minus k cap then plus lambda into b vector b so b1 vector is the you can tell it is the vector ab so the vector ab will be 4 i cap plus 6 j cap plus 2 k cap so this will be 4 i cap plus 6 j cap plus 2 k cap, 2 k cap, sorry. Then the r vector here, this will be equal to c d. So this is minus 4 minus 3, which is minus 7 i cap. Then plus, uh, no, this will be, there's something wrong here. So that would be a2 vector plus lamp plus mu b2 vector. So um, a2 vector will be 3i cap plus 9j cap plus 4k cap plus mu into this will be minus 4 minus 3. So this will be minus 7i cap plus 4 minus 9. This is minus 5j cap. Then, uh, yeah, so then 4 minus 4 will be 0. So therefore, this this a2 minus a1, a2 minus a1, so this will be equal to, this will be equal to, so this is a1 vector, I can tell, this is a2 vector, and this is b1 vector, this is b2 vector. So then a2 minus a1, this will be 3i cap, 9 minus of minus 1, so it is plus 10j cap, plus 4 minus of minus 1, this is plus 5k cap. And then, uh, so therefore we need to find the value of a2 minus a1 dot b1 cross b2. So that will be, so it is the scalar triple product so it will be equal to the determinant of the determinant of this is 3 10 5 and b1 is 4 6 2 this is 0 sorry this is something wrong here this is minus 7 minus 5 and 0 
So if we expand it along the first row, then it will be plus minus plus. So it will be three into three into six into zero. So zero minus of minus ten. So it is plus ten. Then minus ten into zero minus of minus fourteen. So it is plus fourteen. And then plus five into this will be four five is a twenty minus 20 minus of minus 42 so it is plus 42 so this will be 30 minus 140 and this will be um, plus 22 so 22 into 5 this is plus 5 to the 10 110 so this will be 140 minus 140 so that is 0 so since this value is coming zero, so therefore I can tell that, therefore the line through the points A, B, the line through the points A and B, line through the points A and B intersects, intersects the line through the point C and D. So hence proved. Thank you.